Hey there, tech fans. Rick here again with another gadget that I think you're going to find really helpful. It's a rechargeable battery pack that's been engineered to work perfectly with the latest generation of Blink Indoor and Blink Outdoor cameras. It comes from our friends over at Wasserstein, and what they've actually designed here is a product that's really easy to use and can easily extend the recording time of your cameras by well over 50%. Now, if you're already using Blink cameras around your home, you know that you have a camera that offers some of the longest recording times on the planet with a fresh set of lithium batteries. Amazon has done a phenomenal job of engineering this camera to use every available electron in the battery before they need to be replaced. But the challenge with any battery-powered camera is the batteries. Eventually, they're gonna run out of power. You're gonna have to climb up on a ladder, pull down the camera, pop out the old batteries, pop in a new set, and then put it back up there. So under most circumstances, if the traffic's not real high and you're not recording in high definition and you're not recording really long clips, you can get a year and a half, maybe two years out of the batteries, which is fine for most circumstances. But there are a few areas around my house, my front porch, my back deck, and my driveway where the traffic is higher than normal, or maybe I'm recording a little bit longer clip, or maybe I've upped the resolution to get a high resolution clip recorded in those areas. I'm not getting anywhere near two years out of the battery. So I've been on the hunt for a while for an alternative powering solution for those particular cameras. And I've got a few of them that I'm running with solar panels. A couple others I've connected directly up to house power, but there are a few areas around my home where I'm not near the sun during the day and I can't really run power out there where I was looking for a way to extend the battery power inside that camera, and that's exactly what this product is designed to do. It couldn't be simpler. You basically charge it up, you pop it on the camera, put the cover back on, and stick it right back up where you were, and it extends the recording time, like I said, by well over 50%. Now, to give you some numbers, the unit itself has 4,400 milliamp -hour hours of current. Most of the batteries that are out today are around 3,2800. 3 I think these are 3,200 milliamp -hour hours. So again, about a third more power inside the unit. That's the first benefit is the fact that it'll extend your recording time. The bigger benefit for me though is every time I take the camera down and pull the old batteries out and put the new batteries in, I'm bringing these to a recycling center at the big box store. I'm taking them to our local recycling center and I feel terrible with one use batteries. I like rechargeable products. Anything that I can use again and again and again is a good thing for me because it's gonna save me money not buying extra batteries. It's also gonna keep these from ending up someplace, maybe a landfill somewhere else where they're not really gonna do a lot of good. So I love the fact that it's rechargeable and you can recharge it a couple of hundred times, which means if you're using it for two years, just think about that, that's 200 years of charging. So it's gonna outlive me, my kids, my kids' kids. So it's gonna give you a long time of use out of a particular product. So I like it an awful lot. I also love the fact that they've built this to work perfectly with the camera. So I'll show you how to install it in a second, but essentially you pull it back off the camera, pull the batteries out, you pop this on the back, it snaps right onto the camera, and these two units right here fit in where the batteries go. You pop the back on it and you're good to go. Another thing they built into it is a charging indicator on the top, so you know exactly how much of a charge is left in it, and you can charge it through the micro USB connection on the back. Now that's really advantageous because in the kit, you're gonna get the actual battery pack itself. They even include a really nice long cable that has a USB-A in this end and a micro USB on the other end, but when you buy this unit, you actually get a charging cable with it and you get a nice little charging brick. So you can use the brick that comes with the kit and the cable they give you or the cable that came with it to charge the unit up. And it takes probably about three hours. My experience has been two, two and a half hours in most cases, but I haven't run it all the way down. But a fully depleted unit will take about three hours to charge and then you're gonna get a ton of recording time out of it when you pop it back up outside. Another thing they built into it, which I think is really clever, is the camera itself inside has a reset button. So once you snap this on, you're blocking that reset button but they built in a reset button on the top, which is a little hinged thing inside here, a little hinged pivot uh, piece right there that when you push it, it actually impacts the reset button so you can leave this on and reset the camera if you have to to sort of reconnect it to your Wi-Fi. Now, next I'd like to show you how you use the unit. So I'll show you on a Blink Outdoor, for example, how you take the back off, how you add it, and then what you do to put it back up. And then I'll come back with some final thoughts. But for me, I'm always looking for alternative ways to power things around the house because none of us likes getting online and ordering a bunch of batteries knowing that we're gonna go through those batteries and have to replace them in a month. So having something like this that I can recharge at home, put back up, and not have to deal with it for two years, two and a half years in most cases, is a really big benefit for me. So it keeps me off the ladder, it keeps me from buying extra batteries, and I just love the fact that I can recharge it, reuse it, and not have to be buying stuff and throwing things out all the time. It's just a really big benefit. So stay tuned and I'll show you how to use it, then I'll come back with some final thoughts. 
Installing the battery pack is really easy, and it starts by removing the camera from whatever mount you're using. And this is typically attached to your house or maybe a pole in the backyard or a tree. And the way you remove the camera from the mount is just gently pop it off like that, and that'll expose the internal latching bolt that holds the back on. You can use the tool that came with the kit or any flat blade screwdriver to slowly unscrew this. It takes a couple of turns, then the back will pop off. And if you pop off the back, you'll expose the batteries inside. Now, normally there are a couple of lithium batteries in here. You'll wanna pop those out and set them aside because this is the battery you'll be using to power the unit. Now, before you install it, make sure you charge this. And you do that through the USB connection right there. It's a micro USB port. You can use the cable that comes with the kit or any micro USB cable. Connect that up to a USB-A port on your computer or a wall charger or a solar panel, whatever you wanna charge this with. And you'll know you're charging it because these LEDs on top give you an indication of what kind of charge is in the unit at present. So when you're charging, it, each of these represent 25% charge, and you'll notice as it charges, these will move up till they're all lit. Once they're all lit, you've got a full charge in the unit. Now to install it, you want to align the two USB connections on the bottom to make sure that they're aligned. If you put it in like this, it's upside down, so you want to make sure you line it up like that. And then all you have to do to install it is put these two together and then pop them together. You hear a click like that, and that's really on there now. If you have to remove it, you can squeeze here and pop it off, but once it's on there, you'll never have to remove it. Then you install the back just by lining up this grommet on the bottom with the micro USB port right there. And then again, you can use the tool to re-secure that on the back, just tighten it the other direction. And once that's done, you can pop this back on the mount and start using your camera. Now those batteries are already activated. You can see that light blinking on the front. Now, if you need to recharge this, maybe it's gone two years and it's time for a recharge, you don't actually have to pull it off the camera. You can loosen that grommet on the bottom and you'll see the micro USB connection right there. You can connect that up to a cable, bring it in your house, connect it up to a cable and recharge this unit, close the grommet and pop it back up on the mount. So it really is just that simple to use. So now you can see how simple it is to install that on your Blink camera. And I just had a few final thoughts. So I wanted to go through the specs one more time, just so you had them. 4,400 milliamp hours compared to about 3,000 on a standard set of lithium batteries. About three hours to charge it. In the kit, you get the unit, a charging cable, and instructions on the box on how to use it. But you see how simple it is to install. And again, what I love so much about this is it's a simple solution to use. There's no complicated mounting things. You don't have to change the mount on the wall. You basically mount your wall mount like you normally do. You pop your camera off it, take the back off, pop this on it, and pop it back on the mount, and you're good to go. So it's simple to use, it's reusable, it's inexpensive, it's gonna save me buying batteries, and it saves me from getting up on the ladder every other year to change out the batteries that are in there. So everything you need is included with the kit to get started. I think it's a wonderful product. So if you've enjoyed this clip, let me know if you have any questions, drop those in the comments down below and I'll get back to you as quickly as I can. I promise you, I've got a lot more clips I'll be reviewing. This company also makes another unit like this that installs a couple of extra lithium batteries to double the lifespan out of that camera. So I'll be reviewing that very soon as well in case you're interested in that. I love the rechargeable aspects of this one. So for me, this is the one I'm using on most of the cameras around my backyard where I don't have power available, I can't really install a solar panel and it's just working really well. So thanks again for watching and until next time, stay nerdy. Thank mm -hmm. you.